workouts, and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, sidestep plus butt kick. Go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Do not bend or curve your back. Maintain your torso straight by staring at a fixed point in front of you while contracting your abdominals. Don't bend your head. Try constantly looking one step ahead of you. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Next exercise, sidestep plus hip extension. Go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Be sure not to curve or bend your back while doing the exercise. To facilitate the movement, don't rotate the pelvis so as not to diminish the effectiveness. Don't bend the leg and foot. Keep them flat. Don't bend your head. Stare at a fixed point in front of you. Next exercise, high knee march plus arm rotation. Go. Be sure not to lift your shoulders. Keep them down and relax. Don't bend your arms, keep them constantly flat. Don't bend your head, keep it always in line with your back. Next exercise, Dumbbell High Punch. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Next exercise, squat and lateral punch plus squat and side knee kick. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. When you descend, make sure your knees don't pass your toes. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Be sure to keep your knees in line with your toes when you descend. Keep your abs constantly tight during the exercise to improve balance. Next exercise, dumbbell standing side crunch. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Do not bend or curve your back. Maintain your torso straight by staring at a fixed point in front of you while contracting your abdominals. Be sure not to lift your shoulders. Keep them down and relax.
You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Next exercise, Dumbbell Full Standing Twist. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. They should constantly be in line with your toes. Keep your abs and butt constantly tight to maximize the effectiveness of the exercise. Don't lift your heel off the ground during descent. Keep your foot constantly well placed. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Next exercise, standing cross crunch plus dumbbell punch. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Do not strain your neck. Stare at a fixed point in front of you to help you. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Next exercise, Dumbbell Standing Full Side Crunch. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't bend the neck sideways to avoid forcing it. Be sure not to lean the bust forward. The shoulders should be in line with your hips. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Water break. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Do not shift your body weight onto the tips of your feet. In order to maximize the effectiveness of the exercise, the force should be placed onto the heels. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, side step plus dumbbell front punch. Three, two, 
one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Do not bend or curve your back during the exercise. To avoid errors, keep the abdominals tight. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Next exercise, dumbbell standing crunch with outstretched leg. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep your shoulders and head straight throughout the whole exercise. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Be sure not to bend your leg when you lift it. Next exercise, dumbbell squat plus side step. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't bend your back. Keep your abs constantly tight to stabilize the spine. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. Keep them constantly in line with your toes. Be sure not to exceed the tip of the foot with the knee. Don't lift your heel. Keep your foot constantly well rested. Next exercise, dumbbell standing cross crunch. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep the abdomen constantly tight. Do not strain your neck. Stare at a fixed point in front of you to help you. Next exercise, side step plus lateral shoulder raises. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep your elbows and hands at shoulder height when you bring your arms up. Don't lift your shoulders when bringing up the arms. Keep them constantly down and relaxed. Don't bend your neck. Try bringing your chin back. Be sure not to bend your wrists. Your hands should be in line with your forearms. Next 
exercise, side step plus front raises. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Be sure not to bend your wrists. Your hands should be in line with your forearms. Don't lift your shoulders when you bring your arms up. Keep them down and relax. Next exercise, side step plus alternating shoulder raises. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't bend your arms, keep them constantly flat. Don't bend your head, keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Don't move your upper body. Keep your abs tight to control your back movement. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Next exercise, dumbbell standing twist plus lateral punch. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep your abs constantly tight to avoid burdening the spine. Be sure to only rotate your torso. It may help to stare at a point in front of you. Next exercise, high knee march plus curl. Go! If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't swing your back, try keeping your abs tight. Don't lift the shoulders, keep them down and relax by concentrating on your biceps. Don't bend your wrists during the movement, keep your hands in line with your forearms. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Water break. Go! Next exercise, stretching hamstrings. Three, two, one, go! Don't bend the leg. To achieve the maximum elongation, it must always be well stretched. Five, four, three, two, 
1. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go! Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching arms, chest, and shoulders. Three, two, one, go. Be sure not to bend your back. Try staring at a point in front of you. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, spine stretching. Three, two, one, go. Make sure not to lift the lower back during the entire exercise. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Try out our full workout plans. More info in the description below.